Your dance ends now! left you. That you're not the brains behind this. And this smells like distraction. I'm done talking! Coward! What's the matter? Don't like surprises? <laughs> Next time, take better notes. Guess you saw that coming, huh? You think you've won? What the hell are you talking about? Look around, Romanov. The world will remember this day. The day their heroes failed them. <laughs> What's happening here? The city's collapsing. Us. Steve, can you hear me? Get the hell out of there! Vita. Screw this. Thousands of other innocent people died, and many more still bear the scars of what has come to be known as A-Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strict otherworldly powers. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country. To rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought us transformed San Francisco into an infectious These powerful beings that wreak havoc through. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Their activities outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day. But I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. Comforting words to those families torn apart by the disease. But is he too confident? Many criticize AIM's tactics. This so-called resistance army grows stronger every day. This is Phil Sheldon reporting live at the A-Day anniversary. I can't see the revolution right under their noses. Come on. Where'd you guys go? There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Hello there. If you get it right, copy everything. We'll find you. Now we're talking. Whoa, Retro Stark. Do you have a moment to talk, Beta? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. The girls are leaving for the mosque retreat in a couple of hours. 
it's still not too late to meet them at the bus. It was tonight? Kamala, we talked about this. Going to the retreat will be a good time to get away from all of this. Breathe some fresh air, laugh. Nakia will be very disappointed if you don't go. You're right. I'll think about it. Good. Very good. There'll be ice cream, eh? <laughs> oh, and best of all, no boys, so lots of fun. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Beta. I love you more. But you don't get it. Okay, where were we? Password hint. First love. Hmm. Oh. What? Oh. Come on, come on, you got this. Oh, right. Dang! Come on, guys. No way. I can't be it. Oh my god, I'm in! I'm in! I can't believe it! Oh, right. Uh, copy everything. Bless your inflated ego, Tony Stark. <laughs> I really kicked the hornet's nest. Gotta get to headquarters and check out what's on this flash drive.
flying toasters are everywhere. Gotta brace the ramp. Who needs high-tech security when only I could make this jump? Ah, oh, back to the old HQ. It's a mess, but it's my mess. Looking pretty worn out. Wonder if they make any for supersized punches. Ugh, a mare would freak at the sight of this. Well, then again, my brother freaks out over basically everything. Laptops upstairs. Don't want to bump my head jumping up like last time. Just let somebody try to get me at range. Stretchy arms for the win. My laptop. If Abu saw these, he'd throw them out. He still thinks they're the reason for what happened to me on A-Day.
Bill. Well, first, thanks for inviting me to come on your show to set the record straight. As, as the world grows more complex, the dangers we face have adapted. We can no longer take a localized approach to protecting this nation or the world. The Avengers must become a global organization. Our new West Coast headquarters is just the first step. As for the Chimera, and I apologize if I get this wrong, but people much smarter than I am have explained it's powered by the Stark patented Terrigen reactor, capable of generating clean, efficient power. Not only will we be more mobile and more able to react to danger, we're working toward improving the world in peacetime as well as in crisis. Is this helicarrier designed for conflict? Well, yes. The Avenger's primary mission is to defend the public from harm. And sometimes that requires a little muscle, you know? When terrorists attack, even if we do our jobs, damage is done. People get displaced. Whole areas are deprived of power and basic food and water. But with the Chimera as our new mobile headquarters, we'll be able to solve some of these problems. So yeah, the Chimera is a military vessel, but it will also allow the Avengers to give something back to the world. Abu noticed the blood pressure cuff I borrowed last week was missing, but assumed Ami misplaced it and it'll turn up. It's not like he needs to use it anymore. It was just a precaution when he had that heart attack scare. So far, according to the internet, my blood pressure's normal. So is my pulse and my temperature, thanks to that children's thermometer I found in the bathroom cupboard. I'm trying to think of what else I could test to see if I'm getting sick, but that would involve stealing more medical equipment. Kind of wish Abu worked in a hospital instead of a bank. I also kind of wish Abu would let me talk to him more about this stuff. But he wants to pretend like A-Day never happened. He might be the only one in the entire country. In one of the tallest buildings in New York, the Avengers lounged in their tower, waiting for a world needing saving. All was peaceful for once on a rare, calm day for the world's greatest superheroes. That is, until Iron Man barged in the living room, swinging a plunger like a sword. We have a problem, he announced, breaking the peaceful silence and making everyone wince. Dr. Bruce Banner peeked over the glasses resting on his nose. He wrinkled his brow, narrowing his eyes at the interruption to his readings. Uh, you'll have to be more specific. In my toilet, Iron Man answered eagerly. Captain America was wearing a red, white, and blue apron cooking in the kitchen. Captain Marvel came around the corner, still in costume, wiping sweat from her face. Oh, good, I'm starving, she said tiredly. Training S.H.I.E.L.D. agents to fight aliens is not easy. It's gonna be a while, Captain America said, still measuring ingredients. Shall I order pizza then, Thor asked. No, both captains said. Thor looked grumpy. He was the only one who liked pineapple on his pizza.
Let's see what we've got. The Chimera? This must be the reactor room security footage. Dr. Tarleton? But you're supposed to be on the command deck. Oh, Cap. What's going on? No way. Tarleton sealed him in? There was no malfunction. He killed Cap. Oh my god, he killed Cap! What? Tiny Dancer? Oh no. Heroes Park? Hmm. I, I don't know. This could be a trap. But what if it isn't? Someone needs to see this. Just be smart, Kamala. Hand over the proof, and you're done. I'm heading to the park this way. Uh, 
forward, I guess? If Tarleton's lying about the command deck, who knows what else he'd be lying about. to the cap statue. Hello, Heroes Park. It's been a while. My parents used to bring me here all the time when I was a kid. Ames tearing this place down to build their new clinic. Such a waste. Everybody's a critic. Slash vandal. This is what Abu's really worried about. The first person they called inhuman. Wow. It's really been four years. Good place to stake out Cap's statue up ahead. Need a hand, big guy? Tiny dancer? <laughs> hey, hey. Where are you going? Uh, home. Really? We just got here. Hey, 
Want a drink? Ah, no thanks. What? Are you paying your respects? I'm just taking a shortcut, that's all, fellas. <laughs> shortcut. Come on, get out of there. Right. Cool lighter. So you want them back, huh? So they can kill more of us? What? No. No? No? No. What is it then? Hmm? And you must get you going? <gasps> Come on, fellas. Stupid sympathizers. Are you okay? <laughs> Candle Kid's got a girlfriend. Zach, check out her bag. What? What the hell is wrong with you people? I just want to go home, okay, man? <gasps> what are you doing? My kid brother was there on A-Day. He wrote some dumb stuff about Captain America. <laughs> it wasn't Cap's fault. It's all their fault. He turned all freakish and purple. And then they took him away! Hey, take it easy. Zach, enough, no, he's dude. Dead. Stop! He's dead! I said stop! stop. stop. Get back. She's one of them! Oh. Don't let her touch you! We gotta go. Dude, are you okay? Come on, let's go. Don't touch me. What? You're a tiny dancer, right? What do I do with this? What are you talking about? Please, just let me go. Hey! Uh. Gotta move. If they catch me, it'll be my picture they're putting on that wall. Gotta move. If they can. To me, it'll be my picture they're putting on that wall. 